Welcome back to Let's Play Man Me 2, Fall of Alchemy. Last time, we, um, confronted, uh, Riker, and he completely handed, had our butt handed out to us on a silver platter. But, we ended up find, um, finding, um, Eugene, um, uh, Grace's grandfather, and he's recovering in infirmary. So now we're gonna go see him and see what's really going on. So let's go. So, you're here. Are you fine now? Ah, that was nothing. Don't act tough. You were pretty close to dying there. Well, it's not like I took all the damage. I gave some back to him, too. You look pretty fine to me. Anyway, enough of this talk. Right. So, how much do you know? He hunts manas. And he hunted your mana, too. I see. How about how we... Me and Rykoi, uh, that kid, met? I didn't hear about that yet. All right. Then let me start from there. It was about ten years ago. Back then, I was ridiculously powerful. No one in this kingdom could beat me. Hmm. I've heard that story many times. Just listen. Because of my strength, the light mana came to me. It offered me a job to hunt manas. Of course, I turned it down. So instead of me, the light mana chose Reichboy. Uh, Riker. So you knew him? We were only acquaintances. He was about your age now, back then. He was a master swordsman. Super strong, I mean. I was better than him, of course. Stop trying to brag about yourself all the time. Oh, come on. <laughs> anyway, he was strong, but a little too obsessed. He just wanted power, and only fought with the strongest. He challenged me every time we saw each other, and I turned him down every time. I knew if we did fight, one of us would have gotten injured. So he was so frustrated that he took your mana? I guess so. He probably thought I was going to go get him. That's so selfish. That's just how he is. Now that I think back, I should have defeated him back then. So, he's mad that he couldn't fight you, and that's why he's trying to fight Raze? I'm assuming so. I don't know what he was thinking. So I'm just a complete victim here. I'm sorry, but I have one favor to ask. What? Go smash him down for me. That's impossible. <laughs> you didn't even think about it. I just came back from him beating the tar out of me. He's gone completely out of his mind. How can I fight someone like that? I'm asking you. Half of it is my fault that he's like that. Uh, well, not... Not half, but one-third. Maybe one-fifth. Anyway, it doesn't matter. No matter how you feel, he's going to come after you. Are you going to run away from him forever? Ugh. Then whose fault is that? Oh my. This is so sad. If you think you can't win, then I'll help you. What are you saying? If you lose, it means that I, your master, lost too. Do you think I'll keep letting that happen? What kind of reason is that? Plus, even both of us together wouldn't... If my owner says she will, then I don't have a choice. Me neither. I'm gonna be fighting anyway. I'll go too! He's stronger than Ray's, right? Wow! That sounds like fun! Pony! Pony me! My sister's all fired up to finally show her real power. You guys... 
Now, it's all up to you. Mr. Eugene is always joking around, but I'm sure he's serious about this. I'm sure he is too. You don't have to tell me that, I know. Oh, well how about this? If you defeat that Mr. Riker person, I'll forgive you for what you did. Really? What? Why do you want me to fight him so badly? Don't you want to? But you're just pretending like you don't care, because you know you can't beat him alone. Don't act like you know me. Plus, it's going to bug you so much if you don't do this now. She has a point. Then I'm going to be in trouble, and Miss Lily alone is quite a handful. I'd have to take care of Mr. Ray's in a bad mood. Fine, I'll do it. Just don't complain if we lose. Okay! Yay! Anyway, who's a handful? Oh, no! I was just saying that to try to convince Mr. Ray's. Just because I was being nice to you since your injury? It's not like that! Oh, oh, what are you doing? Those hands! <laughs> <laughs> well, you saw all that. I'm glad you're getting what you want. Don't be so sarcastic. Well, I'm counting on you. I just want to ask you one more thing. What is it? When your mana disappeared, why did you lie to me? Why didn't you just say that it was hunted by that guy? Then, you would have hated him forever. I didn't want you to grow up hating people. But I didn't expect you to twist things around and hate the manor. I got that from you. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, old fart. Looks like he's asleep. Okay, that's all you get for today. He looked fine, but he's severely injured. Let's go, Raze. All right. Okay, for this part, talk to if you have all your character requests done, if you talk to one of them, you'll get one of their endings, but if you leave, you'll get another ending. So, for this one, I'll use Pick Punio. See where we can find Riker. I guess he's not here. I wonder if she was okay. Can't you smell him or something? Even our sense of smell can't detect someone far away. Look, a blood stain. Is it his? It's going over there. All right, let's go. I guess we got a lead.
The Dragon Graveyard. the battle, but he ran away. Oh well, I can wait till I'm better. It'll be better tomorrow morning. I think I'll end it here. Yeah, I'll end it here. Next time on Man Chameleon 2, we head through the final dungeon of Race's story, the dragon, the dragon Graveyard, to find Riker. Until then, guys, see you later. <laughs>